Good morning, dear students. Hope you all are fine. Today, in this computer class, we are going to start a new chapter, chapter 6, Word Bad. Okay, children? First, what is Word Bad? Word Bad is an application software which we use for writing poems, stories, and letters, etc. While writing in it, we can use many options for making our text attractive, presentable, and error-free. So, let us start with WordPad. First, how to start WordPad? Do you know children? Yes, first you have to click the start button, then click all programs and start menu, then move your pointer on accessories, then click wordpad option in it. After clicking wordpad, wordpad window will appear on the desktop. Listen children, this is WordPad window. Can you see this? Yes. Now, the WordPad window has some components. What are the components? Let us see one by one. First, WordPad tab. Okay, this is WordPad Tab. Tabs. This is a ribbon. And this one is cursor. And this is work area. Here you can see ruler. And then these are the control buttons. Okay, children. First, what is WordPad tab? WordPad tab gives options to open, close, save, or print the text file. See, you can see this option. Yes. Next, tabs and ribbon. There are two tabs in it. That is, home and view tab. Which have different set of commands arranged in ribbon. Listen children, these are ribbon. Okay, so in ribbon, you can see many commands. Then next, this is ruler. Okay. It shows the width of your text document. It means it shows the size of the document. Then work area. Listen children, this is work area. The blank space is there now. So this is work area. This is the place where we enter our Type the text. Okay, children, if you want to type anything, you have to type the text here. Okay. And then this one is cursor. It shows the typing position in the document. So now here we can start type the text. Okay. So now here is the cursor, so we can start type here. Okay. Is it clear, children? Yes. Now, how to add text in WordPad document? The blinking line on the work area is known as the cursor. So listen, children, this is cursor. Okay. So the blinking cursor in your WordPad 
work area shows that it is ready for typing. So let's enter some text here. Okay. Enter. Okay. Listen, children. Here, I enter the text. Like this, you can enter any text here. Okay. Now, how to change the text style? Okay. Now, for that, you have to select the text first. Okay, now I am going to select text. To change the style of writing, we can use font option in the home tab. See here, this is home tab and this is font group. Okay, so you can use this font group for changing the text style okay so first you have to select the text and then you have to click here the font font drop down button okay so you can get many options here okay new writing style you can select any of any one of this style see the selected text is changed so again you want to change this text Like this. Okay. okay. Again I am selecting. Okay. You can see now. Is it clear children? Okay. Next. How to align the text? There are four types of alignments are there. What are the four types? Left alignment. Center alignment, right alignment, justify alignment. Okay, so these are the four types of alignments and these are the alignment buttons. Okay, so we can use this alignment buttons to align the text in our document. Okay, for that I am going to type one sentence. Now, this is a paragraph. Now, I am going to align this paragraph. Okay. For that, I am going to select the paragraph. So, now it is in left alignment. Okay. I am going to click center alignment. Okay. Then right alignment. Justify alignment. Then left alignment. Okay, children. Now clear now. Okay, children. Is it clear now? I hope all these topics are clear to you. We will continue this chapter in the next class. Thank you. God bless you.